So what's going to be on Griffith is a media collection manager. Um, so let's open this here. Now this one is cross-platform, so you can use it on um, you know your Mac, Windows, and Linux. Uh, no issues there. So I have a few movies here. And if you never use this, you know, the first thing you want to do is add your movies here. So I'm going to search for uh, Gattaca. And they have a few databases here, like, you know, IMDB is by default. But if you have, like, different languages, like, I think this is Italian or something like that. Or if you're using, like, anime, you probably use, like, NEDB or something like that, right? Uh, so just choose the one that you want if you didn't find the results uh, that you had on IMDB. Then you just hit uh, get from web here, and it's gonna try to find the results. Uh, depending, you know, if they have like different names that matches it or something like that. Like um, sometimes they have American names and you know some other ones on different languages. But this is the one I want here. And now it's gonna you know get the cover art, the details of it, and everything. Even the ratings here from IMDb, right? Uh, some other stuff you know like plot and cast and everything like that so that's pretty much it um, you hit the add movie here and it adds it to your database I guess uh, if you want to do this manually you can just type in you know the title add in your own uh, what was that uh, cover and then fill in all the other information like plot and cast if you didn't find the the correct one or something or if you want to edit the one that you have already then you can do that also right um, Pretty much it. Uh, well, they do have this loan option. Like if you, you say you loan a DVD to your friend or something. I don't know if anyone does that anymore. But, you know, they still have it here if you want to do that, right? Uh, if you want to do that there. And as far as if you've seen it, um, you know, by default, it's checked it when you say, you know, you add it in. But let's say you haven't seen it, then you check it and it'll be unchecked it here. You can't really do it from clicking on here. You know, I don't know why, but... You have to have to right click on it and then you can say seen it or whatever. So that's how they do that. And well, they do have some other ways to export it, right? You want to export it to your iPod or whatever it is, PDF, uh, even GC Star, which is another program for a collection um, similar to this. So you're going to use that also. Anyways, uh, pretty old application, it hasn't been updated in a while. But it still works fine, and adding it is really easy and really quick, right? And whenever you need to find a movie, they have a filter option here. So if you want to search for uh, Matrix, um, you know, it'll filter out everything else, and then you just find the Matrix here. So that's pretty much it for the program. If you want to install it, it should be in your, you know, your default repositories, whatever distro you're using. Anyways, that'll be it for this one.